And joining me now is His Eminence, Colonel Sean O'Malley. And Your Eminence, thank you for being with me today. I really want to talk about this health care bill and what is the reaction of Catholics or what should be our reaction to this health care bill? Well, for decades, the bishops have advocated for universal health care. Uh, we're very concerned about the large numbers of people who are uninsured or underinsured and uh, don't have access to uh, adequate health care. Uh, however, the present legislation as it stands is very uh, concerning to us because it provides for abortion funded by the government, something that in the past uh, was never permitted in the United States. and. Uh, and there has not been uh, care to incorporate conscience clauses so that Catholic doctors and health care workers would not be uh, forced uh, by the government to participate in an abortion. Uh, those kinds of things are very, very disturbing to us. And uh, we're also anxious to make sure that the health care bill does take care of all of the poor, and particularly immigrants and, uh, and those who are most in need. But the overriding concerns at this moment are about the funding of abortion and the, uh, the lack of clear conscience clauses to protect uh, the rights of people. And there seems to be a few different agendas uh, within this bill that people are, are, are really focusing this bill on, which is not a good thing whatsoever. What can we as Catholics do to say to our politicians, wait, oh, wait a second, this isn't what we're looking for. There are certain parts of this bill that we do agree with, but there are certain parts that not only don't we agree with, it is against everything we believe in. Well, I think it's very important for people to contact uh, their legislators and share their concerns with them. Uh, the polls have been very interesting. Uh, it's something like 70 percent of the Americans are against using federal funds to uh, pay for abortion. So I mean, it's the overwhelming uh, desire of the ca of the American people. This isn't just Catholics, uh, but we certainly would encourage everyone to perhaps visit the web page at the USCCB where we uh, deal with these issues, but we're anxious to have people contact their legislators to, to tell them that we, we want a health care package, but we don't want a health care package that funds abortions or does not incorporate clear uh, conscience clauses in the legislation. So are we ultimately looking for, to make sure that this health care bill is concerned with the dignity of all people. Yes, certainly, and, and we believe in the dignity of every human person from the first moment of conception till natural death. And if we've learned anything, it's that if we keep silent, then we're in trouble. This is a very crucial moment for us in the whole history of our country. This is a very important moment, and we hope that Catholics will step up to the plate. So make sure that you, your voices are heard. Go to that USCCB website, United States Catholic Conference of Bishops. Read more, educate yourself on it, the importance of it, and then make sure that your voice is heard. Thank you very much.